Good morning everyone. I hope you're all really, really well. I hope you guys are having a fabulous week. It is currently the last weekend of August, which means only one thing. Summer is over. Hello autumn. Hello fall. It's the most wonderful time of the year. When you guys see this actually, wait, wait a minute. I need to check. My prediction was correct. When you guys see this video, it will be September. How long have we waited for this moment? Hello, September. So today we are taking our annual trip to HomeSense. I mean, is there actually a better activity than going to HomeSense on the 1st of September? I don't think there is. In the, in the name of autumn, I have picked out one of my favourite jackets, which is brilliant because it's long enough to wear as a dress. The end of August and September does tend to be, I hate to say it, but a little bit warm. We're not, we're not quite at the crisp autumn mornings yet. So this is great because you feel autumnal, but you don't feel too hot. It's time guys, it's time to go to HomeSense and get cozy, get yourself a PSL, pumpkin spice latte, and let's go on our annual home sense shopping trip. I've just had a little coffee. Oh, I thought that was I thought that was a Christmas cup then. What is that? Football World Cup. Jamie also got a beans with a Z and cheese toasty. Oh, it looks nice. Contents may cause happiness. You'll have to let us know if it makes you happy. I'll let you know. Give me uh, five minutes. I asked them to put cold water in this today because black Americanos honestly take, I'd probably say about two hours to be drinkable. <laughs> intentions for today's home sense trip as you guys know i went about probably like three weeks ago now um and they had a lot of autumn bits in but i don't feel like it was its full potential so i wanted to wait until like the end of august and i'm hoping it's autumn galore in there i would <laughs> like to get some more pumpkins because I don't feel like I have enough. Um, I've got quite a good collection actually, but not, I feel like I want like a, a statement pumpkin. Prefer a statement yeah, pumpkin. Yeah, preferably that like. And you've rang them as well, don't forget to say. Yes. Gemma's been on the phone every single day. Not every day. They just got home sets on speed dial at this point, but preferably like a light up pumpkin. Cause I think that would look cute in the hallway. Like maybe one big enough to go on the floor. Um, like a big wicker one. That's that's what I'm putting out into the universe today. So <laughs> a big hopefully, wicker light at pumpkin. Yeah. Also really like to get some bits for when we decorate the porch. So excited for that. Before we set off on our travels, Jamie, I have a question for you. Go ahead. Can I put some Christmas music on? Absolutely not. It's not Christmas yet. Oh, Jamie's one of those people that doesn't feel like it's Christmas until December. Yeah, it's bloody... It's, we clash, guys. It does go on too long. We, we clash, like... It, I'm not gonna lie, it, it does upset me to my core that you don't want to listen to Christmas music at the end of August. Still summer. When is the end of summer officially? Are we, are the we in autumn? The 31st of August. So I think it's like the 22nd of September, but not today, to, but not for us, okay? The f like, autumn starts now, today, today. Look how wobbly the camera is. <laughs> what, is it wobbly? Oh, sorry you're guys, moving. you're like shaking around everywhere. Um, <clears throat> Jamie, listen, you you gotta get you gotta you gotta get with it. it. It's not summer anymore. Let it go. <laughs> I just feel like Michael Bublé would really set the mood of today. Absolute no. That makes me feel sick this time of year. Michael Bublé in shorts. <laughs> <laughs> I typed in Michael and it came up with Jackson. You wanna listen to Michael Jackson instead? Yes. Much rather listen to Michael Jackson. Hang on, Billie Jean. Billie, Billie Jean, Jean is, is not my lover. lover. Just the girl that thinks that I am the one. Oh, you must have spelled it wrong, Gemma. Let's begin it's beginning to look, look a lot like Christmas. Christmas. I've arrived. I can see all of the Halloween bits in there. Actually, I can see two skulls kissing. Can you guys see that? <laughs> no. Yeah, look. 
<laughs> there's like a wedding. Oh my god, there's like a bridal skull and a bridal groom. <laughs> Okay, as you come into Home Sense, this is the first thing I'm greeted with, which is basically an autumn aisle. Oh my goodness. So, I'm, I'm instantly drawn to the candles, you see. So, we've got autumn harvest. So cute. We also have as well this reed diffuser. Oh my goodness, look at those little pumpkins on there. I feel like I may need to get this for the hallway. This is pumpkin cinnamon. Then we also have as well, look at these like logs. They would be cool for the dining table or actually on the fireplace they'd look nice we also have as well cinnamon baked apple i bet that smells amazing oh my goodness look at all of these halloween goodies look at these these are place card holders they've got pumpkin ones skull ones <laughs> no these are these tea are light holders glasses. oh my god Wow, imagine serving a shot in that. God. Happy Halloween. Here's a shot of... What's something spooky? What's what's brain. a spooky shot? Here's, here's a shot of brain. There are so many... Oh my god, I know what this is from. We were talking about this last night. Um, Something Book of Horrors. Little Shop of Horrors. Little Shop of Horrors. We were trying to... We were talking... It's really funny because we were talking about this flower last night. Don't ask me why. But we had a conversation about it and we couldn't think what film it was from. The plant's got a name, is not it? What's the plant's name? I don't know. And it goes, feed me Seymour. <laughs> so we've got some little Happy Halloween glasses. Jamie thought that said 800. <laughs> yeah, 800 what? 800 what exactly? Oh, Alice, oh look at Casper and his pumpkin. Many skulls, guys. Our wedding many, day. many skulls. <laughs> Our wedding day. Yeah. What so is that? Is by that? The time it gets I there. was literally about to say. <laughs> skull with rats coming out of its eye. What's this? Snake venom. Oh my god, there's so many different like skulls. Oh look, loads of fox things. Oh, this is cute. This is more like it, Jamie. What's that? It's a squirrel. That's a fox. Oh, I love him. Whoa. Wow. Should we have this on our porch? Fox, no way. Is that a wicker pumpkin? Wait, is that a wicker? That's a wicker cat, Jamie. <laughs> you know I said I wanted a wicker. I need to turn it round. It's got to be in here somewhere. That's an owl. <gasps> I mean, that's that's, that's as close as I'm going to get to a wicker pumpkin. I think we should get it. Oh, look at it. That would look so cool 20. on the porch. Is that what you want to get? Do you get it? Should we get it? Yeah. Does it light up? Because that was my dream. <laughs> you could put a light in. Wow! I reckon you could put a light in it. On, Meanwhile, Jamie's walking around with a wicker owl. <laughs> on, I think personally we should get this for Teddy. I think we should get it for the owl. <laughs> I think it suits him. So we've got some Halloween-y doormats here. We've got a happy Halloween one. But we're gonna make one. Some more we? skulls. Yes, we are gonna make one. We're gonna make a DIY um, autumn doormat, which, and that video is coming very, very soon. So stay tuned for that. We've got a happy Halloween one down here. That one's actually really cute. Look at these skull throws. Cobweb throws. I'm not gonna lie guys, I'm I'm not that keen on these. <gasps> I'm very tempted to get this for Teddy. Imagine him in that. I mean he definitely wouldn't fit in it, but how cute. Got some Halloween cushions. Eat, drink, and be scary. Oh wow! They're cute, they're little candles, little pumpkin ones. They look good on the porch. Oh my god, good idea. Oh, this is cute. Is this light up? No, wait, yeah, there's well, something in it. Careful, the lid don't fall off if it's got a lid, it hasn't. <laughs> Maple pumpkin, there's something inside of it, but there's no way to get to it. Oh, I think it might be like a tea light holder. Yeah, but how are you going to get the tea light in there? I don't know. Oh no, it's just scented. There's like a maple scent thing in there. 
Wow, look at this. Skeleton cushion, anyone? Candles galore. Oh my goodness, look at them all. <gasps> they have so many, I actually don't even know where to start. Wow, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> that smells so good though. It smells different oh, to uh, spice what it pumpkin. looks like. Oh my goodness, guys, I actually, I don't even know where to start. I'm in candle Check this one heaven. Out. Wow. Chocolate pumpkin spice. Let's smell it together. Mm, it smells kind of like coffee. Yeah, it does. Mm. Chocolate, chocolatey coffee. Nice. Oh god. My name's Gemma, and I have a candle addiction. Pumpkin. Pure pumpkin. One hundred percent pumpkin. Let's have a sniff. It smells nutty. Yeah, I think that's what pumpkin is, though. Pumpkin is actually a nut. Is it? <laughs> no, it's just. Oh my god, I've literally like, I've spent my entire life not knowing that pumpkin is a nut. It's a vegetable. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this one. Does that it. not just get you in your autumn feels? Harvest leaves, sorry. Smell harvest leaves. It smells kind of fruity. It smells like compost. No, it doesn't. No, it smells a bit apple-y, doesn't it? Like yeah, apple and spicy. It's like apple, so. pumpkin, spicy. <gasps> what one should we do next? I'm just googling, is pumpkin a vegetable? Pumpkin soy latte. Oh. Oh, it's a fruit. If you have to get that close to a candle and smell it. A pumpkin is a fruit. Is it? Conclusion. It says a pumpkin from a botanist perspective, it's a fruit because it's a product of the seed. Jamie with the autumn facts and home sense. Vanilla pumpkin, one of my ultimate faves actually. I do love a bit of vanilla. Ooh. Let's have a sniff. It's like this like fresh vanilla there. It's not really Vanilla is usually quite a warm scent, isn't it? But that's a bit more oh, I'm in my element. You know what guys? If I'm ever feeling down, Ooh, just tell me to get myself to home sense down the candle aisle because all my problems are fixed when I'm here. Have a sniff. Chocolate pumpkin sea salt. I'm not keen on that one. No. See, I'm more of a, a, a pumpkin spice, vanilla pumpkin kind of gal. Caramel apple. Ooh. Ooh. Get in my nose. <laughs> get. Ooh. That's, oh, that's vanilla. What's that one? I just want to stick this one under my nose. Is that just pure vanilla? 100% pure no, vanilla? No, caramel apple. <gasps> Pumpkin pie. Go on then. Oh wow. Look at this one. That's autumn in a candle. Ooh. I'm not keen on that one. Pumpkin pie. Mm -hmm. Fruity. Mm. This one is just called Halloween. <laughs> Burnt caramel and pumpkin. It doesn't really then. smell of anything that one. Oh, I like the burnt caramel. I didn't think I would. Let's have a sniff. I don't touch my lip. <laughs> More shot glasses. What are these? Oh, these are cute. They're in like a little box, little scented pumpkin candles. We've got That's honey pumpkin. Oh, I love that. I love that. I think I might need to get that. Vanilla pumpkin. <gasps> I love that pot. That's so nice. Give it a quick sniff. Wow. Mm. Pumpkin donut. <laughs> These I'm candles hungry. scare me though because they look like the shape of Yankee candles and Yankee candles make your house black. They make literally the they ceilings and the walls black. So, oh. But if you are looking for, like if you like like a Halloween, like a proper Halloween, we're talking like skull kind of decor. I just keep seeing Jamie in the background like analyzing this wicker owl. <laughs> um, if you love like a skull, um, you know like your proper Halloween decor, they have loads. I always find it really rare that you find something that's um, 
a little bit more autumnal rather than Halloween. Like they don't really have any ceramic pumpkins today, which is a shame, um, or anything like that. The only the only pumpkin I've actually seen is this velvet one here. <laughs> Every time I look around, Jamie's just like. This is funny. Eyes were circular, like you'd have to like, you know, it's all like weaved in. I'm so happy that we're getting him. I think he's gonna look so fab on our autumn porch. Oh my god! You think we could make a wicker owl? <laughs> Imagine DIY video: how to make a wicker owl. We can pretend we made this one. Well, we can't now because everyone's seen us buy it. <laughs> Corral coming through. <laughs> that would look nice in that show. Hey guys welcome to upstairs the food and drink section i actually think this section is extremely underrated because you can find some real gems oh you love a bit of nougat i love all the fun fun oils something i never quite thought i'd say i got this last time which is the white truffle oil and it's amazing but you can get some really nice like bottles which look really nice on display like this one love as well one of my favorite things is the fun pastas um actually <gasps> these look like little colored pumpkins i think i may need to get those and refill one of the jars on my kitchen shelf Ooh, that's a um, idea. isn't it mm. autumnal pasta right it's going straight in my basket <laughs> they've got loads of different ones zoo zoo pasta we also have <gasps> teddy pasta oh they're little teddy bears. <laughs> Cute. Snack cake. Yeah, chickpea just snack like a, cakes. Use a big crisp. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> <laughs> a big, real big crisp. Got some other bits here. Oh, sorry. Whoa. Sorry, guys. I feel like I'm talking a lot about pasta, but look at the size of that. Right, what have we got round here? I spy coffee syrups. Last time I was here, I struck absolute gold, guys, and I found the original pumpkin spice um, coffee syrup. So today we have got, oh, caramel pecan sounds nice. Salted caramel, caramel pecan, caramel fudge, salted caramel, vanilla caramel cream, caramel cheesecake. The are really loving their caramel at the moment i also just spotted as well look at this guys toasted marshmallow ground coffee that sounds amazing <gasps> there's a maple nut crunch one as well oh <gasps> cute chocolate, chocolate spoons. spoons of nice coffees toasted coconut chocolate cappuccino Ooh, gooey caramel fudge brownie that sounds amazing they literally have so many nice ones. What else have we got? Cookie dough coffee. Maple fudge. Berry vanilla. Little lint tin. This reminds me of Christmas. Look at this. It's like a little selection of all different lint chocolate. Bojangles. If you haven't tried Bojangle truffles, Monty Bojangle, I love you, they are amazing. Panettone, Christmas vibes, cookies and biscuits. These kind of biscuits always remind me of Christmas because mum always gets like an Italian selection of biscuits that we have with coffee. Um, and they're always like these cute little 
biscuit assortments. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Little autumn like reheatable, um, you know, pots that you like pop in the microwave. Oh my God, look, they've got pumpkin ones, that ones. This leaf one is really cute. I love those. I might have to get this one, this pumpkin one here. I think that's so nice. Imagine little autumnal spice soup in there. These are $3.99, which is an absolute bargain. So many nice, like really different microwavable little tubs, which are brilliant for lunch. Like they've literally got so many different ones, color coordinated, which makes me very happy. They literally have like a pink section here. Then they have a blue section here. I love these like stone ones. I think they're so nice. Oh, this is a nice mug. It's a nice size, I like a nice big mug. 3 .99. Then we've also got some nice French presses over here. Baby pink ones and this pretty yellow one as well. Oh, these mugs are huge. These are so nice. Little stacking mugs and each one says coffee. They are £10. I love like the little black frame. I think they're well nice. Okay guys, we are in wicker basket heaven. Look at all these beautiful wicker baskets. I love this one. How nice. 20 pounds, they've got it in all different sizes. So you've obviously got large one, medium one, small one. I feel like the round ones, especially one like this, would be so perfect to have some really cozy throws in there. I love that. I might actually, I might get a new one and replace the one we currently have in the living room. Because I feel like I've got too many throws for that one. It's a little bit small, but just thinking about how, how many throws I could fit in that. Oh, these would be really nice. You know, in my last vlog, I said that I really want to kind of give the launch, give the utility room a little bit of a makeover. I might be able to find some nice little like laundry baskets. Ideally, I would like two matching ones that say something like laundry on them. Um, but then I think maybe I'd like two wicker ones. I feel like these two would look really nice in there. Bathroom section. I always think Home Sense just has the best little bathroom accessories. I love this kind of like stone one here. I think that's really lovely. Like they just do the best selection. I also think they do great jars like this as well to keep like cotton wool pads in and like earbuds and stuff like that. They also have as well so much like draw organization bits and makeup organizers I also have over here loads of really nice mirrors and also some trays i'm on the hunt for a tray for my dressing table island i wanted one that was kind of like this actually that was i didn't want anything mirrored i wanted it just to have like a really simple black outline because i feel like that would go in the dressing room really nicely how gorgeous is this? It's got a marble top and like sage green drawers. That's so nice. They've got loads of really nice actually bathroom units here. The thing that I just spotted that I really wanted to show you guys is this really tall jar here. I think that would be really nice with like some of that colored pasta in. They've got loads of really nice jars actually. Loads of like the mason jars. I love this tray. So nice with the little gold handles. This would look so nice in the kitchen, but it is £40, which is quite expensive, but it is huge. They've got loads of really nice trays, actually. This one's lovely. They've got loads of nice wooden trays, which I've spent forever looking for. And they've got loads of different ones, like nice coffee table trays. I forgot to mention that we are at the Bedford Home Sense today. It's the one that I usually come to because I find it's always got new stuff in. Do you know what I mean? Um, I've been to some that kind of always have the same stock, but I find this one is really big as well. Like there's a bottom floor and a top floor. Love this. How nice is that? They've actually got so many nice like chairs in this bulk material so nice love the little black legs on that as well oh look at these 17 month desktop calendar 
I love how big they are. I was actually thinking about these the other day that I could do with like a really big planner um, that I could like write my videos on and stuff so I can see it really clearly. I've just got home, I've got Teddy rubbing around my feet. Hello my darling. Are you okay? How are you? You had a nice day? My loves, we have just got home. I am just about to go upstairs and take my makeup off and put some comfy clothes on. Um, and then I'm gonna cook dinner and we're just gonna have a cozy little evening tonight. Um, it's actually quite late, like it's half six. We left here at half 11 and we've literally been out all day. Um, now we've moved house, Home Sense is about an hour and a half away. So it was a little road trip, but we got some really cute bits, which I'm really excited to show you guys. I'm going to be vlogging this week and I'm gonna film like a, a getting ready for autumn vlog. Um, I've got loads of home bits to show you before we actually decorate for autumn, which I'm going to be doing next week. So I want to show you all of like my new home bits and I've also got some new in bits in my wardrobe as well. Um, and I really want to have like a little bit of a wardrobe declutter. So I'm going to do that in this week's vlog as well. So I will catch up with you guys properly on Sunday. Really hope you enjoyed coming to Home Sense with us today. It was actually really good. They had loads of autumn bits in. I feel like Home Sense is one of those places, I've said it before, if you have one locally to you, you need to go like every week to get the really good stuff because I just feel like once it's there, it's gone. Do you know what I mean? Um, so I wish I lived a little bit closer so I could go every single week, but I'm happy with what we picked up and I'm looking forward to showing you guys. Anyway, I hope you're all having a lovely week. Happy September 1st. Cannot wait for the autumn content to come and I will catch up with you guys on Sunday. Bye-bye.